FISBA's full activist, Monginko Sikanyile, says that the struggle for free education continues. He was released from Durban's Westville prison this morning following a ruling by the Constitutional Court yesterday. Kanyile spent the past five months in jail after he failed to get bail in the lower court several times. He was arrested during the FISMAS fall protest in Durban. Kanyile faces multiple charges including public violence and possession of explosives. Stepping out of Westfield prison, he received a hero's welcome from fellow students. We are very grateful because he was fighting a noble cause, something that we were passionately about. That's why we are actually here. Students are unhappy, they're upset because of the brutality of the state towards students. We are very grateful for Bonkos for his sacrifice and we are very happy that he finally has been released. Uh, the Berkeley has begun. Kanyele's mother says she's delighted to take her son home. <laughs> All young people need to be educated. Those who are taking this struggle for granted will one day understand when they are benefiting from it. Kanyele says he's overwhelmed by the support he's received from around the world. He maintains the struggle for free education is far from over. In South Africa, a student of South Africa, we have determined our fate. Yeah. We say we want free decolonized education. Come hello, high water. Despite being behind bars, Kanyele managed to complete his diploma in public administration. Londi Khatebe, SAPC News, Devon.